Not everything man touches instantly becomes a masterpiece. What a bore if it did. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. And sometimes nobody notices. for sure. It helps to be a little different. To make your own rules. But let's face it, if we'd had a style like Picasso, would we have gotten good grades in school? What makes a couple of words a poem? What makes a couple of tones a symphony? What makes a couple of parts a Porsche? Sometimes, there's only one thing to do. Stick to it. And discover that one standout idea that changes the world a little bit. a work into a work of art that touches us and the generations after us.
of auto design were a time of pure innovation. When a few pioneers had the courage and conviction to stake everything they had to make their visions come true. They experimented. They developed pioneering technologies and established new commercial ventures. And they had success. The result was a series of breathtaking designs, which not only set new benchmarks in performance, but also proved their reliability for the road in the most demanding environment there is, the racetrack. At Porsche, that passion for pure innovation is now more powerful than ever. Le Mans, June 14, 1998. It was here that the idea of a road-going Porsche, based exclusively on race technology, originally took shape. With an open top monocoque and edge and subframe made of lightweight carbon fiber. Powered by a new evolution of a thoroughbred racing V10. Developing 612 horsepower at 8,000 RPM and weighing just 205 kilograms. Equipped with pushrod actuated inboard suspension, derived from the Le Mans winning GT1. Featuring the ultimate in high performance brake technology, the Porsche ceramic composite brake. And for the first time ever in a standard production car, the Porsche Ceramic Composite Clutch. The pure culmination of more than 50 years of Porsche race engineering. Filled with emotion. Free from convention. Just like every other Porsche before it. The Porsche Carrera GT.